what will happen if there is a conflict and we cannot uh, manage to reach out to people who want to go to conflict. People who are in the beginning of this journey and have limited tools you can just put it that are really important in the community living are surrounded by people who already have something to offer and to share, to bring them closer to another way of solution. In order to survive, if any of our resources is under five, our tribe, at the end of the process, will die. The balloons stand for the resources, divided by color. And there was yellow for light, red for heat, blue for water, and green for food. We get to this name Homophonia, we thought that being a very small tribe, the consensus, even if it's kind of a long process, in four people it's manageable. The name was Pale de Fico, and one thing that we discussed a lot is minorities and how to give power also to people that think in a different way. We tried to take care of, of our tribe first and we saw what we had extra and what was missing. The moment we understand that, we went for trading. Oh, thank you. It was good trusting you. The name of the okay, tribe was the Oaks. They decided to go for a direct democracy. It seems to be a problem for other tribes that thought we were taking too much time taking decisions. About the resources, most of them wanted to share. But then some other people in the group uh, wanted to be more like a game and try to win the game. What, would like what you want? Are you sure? You want some light? Water. Yes. Okay. Light. <laughs> light. I'm not sure. No, we trade food for light from him and then we bring the light here and get the water. But they do have extra water. They do we have, do have extra water. Ooh, yeah, guys. We'll take care of it. Don't Thank you. <laughs> By the way, what's your name? Pozzo. We were the Pozzo tribe and uh, we chose a system of organizing that was based on the commons. For us as a tribe, uh, non-violence was, was one of our founding uh, values. We had uh, false information about uh, the availability of resources for everyone, which uh, we countered by commoning the resources altogether. I think we need to start trading because, I mean... Η φυλή ομοφωνία, η οποία εξ αρχή σκέφτηκε να προτείνει τη συνεργασία όλων των φυλών να λύσουν από κοινού το θέμα τη επιβίωση του. Αλλά αυτό για πρακτικού λόγου του παιχνιδιού δεν ήταν δυνατό να επιτευχθεί. Οκ, so, do you want to put all the resources together and split them? In this part of the game, it's okay. Let's see in the 10 minutes after that I think a lot of things going to change and then we will have to find a way. Μετά το δεύτερο γύρο έγινε και μια φυσική καταστροφή οπότε από κάποιες ομάδες αφαιρέθηκαν πόρη. Η φυλή ομοφωνία πήρε νερό από τους Oaks. Στο σημείο που είχαν το αυτό το πολύ καλό well-being, κατάλαβαν ότι πρέπει να θυσιάσουν ένα αγαθό, το έδωσαν στους Oaks. Η φυλή the Oaks Για να αποφασίσουν έπρεπε να ψηφίσουν και να καταλήξουν όλοι μαζί σε κάτι. Το οποίο φάνηκε στο τέλος όμως ότι συναισθηματικά τους φόρτισε πολύ. Παρ' όλα αυτά αυτό το group πραγματικά δουλεύτηκε στους τρόπους και στις διαδικασίες που επικοινωνεί. I learned that communication skills are very important. And that uh, with time pressure we, we can judge very fast. That I was very surprised that nobody actually went to war. So it was the first time that uh, I did uh, this kind of activity where there were no conflicts at all. It's important to have someone in the group who says, I want a conflict. But then they have the others who can guide them through on the different options and alternatives and bring them closer to another way of solution. Considering the fact that the option of war has been discussed in any group actually, in the end we we managed to cooperate, so it's been a nice proof of how humans can actually deal in periods of scarcity. The Fili Pozzo, in the beginning of the game, through the collaboration and the diplomatization, has reached a very good technology. It was a profound social experiment of the tensions that can arise 
in the conflicting decision-making processes that we had. Had the circumstances been uh, just slightly differently, we weren't far from that, because there were important suggestions of violence. Η τελευταία φυλή ήταν η Πάλε Ντιφίκο. Γενικά ήταν πολύ σταθερή στου πόρου του. Έκλεισαν και την πόρτα του όταν καταλάβανε ότι είναι αυτάρκη. Μ' άρεσε πολύ ο ρόλο μου. Μ' αρέσει να κυκλοφορώ από μέρα σε μέρα. Έχουν φτάσει στο τέλο όλε οι ομάδε σε βαθμολογία πάρα πολύ καλή. Ήρθαν για πρώτη φορά σε επικοινωνία και σε διαδικασία αυτή τη λήψη αποφάσεων. Σίγουρα η αλληλεπίδραση όλη αυτή τους έχει φέρει κοντά με τον ένα ή τον άλλο τρόπο. Θα συζητήσουμε και τι παίρνουμε από αυτή την εμπειρία για να διαμορφώνουμε τους κανόνες με τους οποίους ζούμε μαζί. It was about uh, bonding and, uh, and communicating and uh, finding a way in a non-violent form to assure that uh, everybody is safe and everybody feels well. So it was a nice uh, experience.